Hi, I'm Teniola Shoboale. Here's your Channel TV Evening News Recap for December the 4th, 2021. About 65 members of the Baptist Church and others who were kidnapped by bandits in Kaduna State have been freed by their abductors. The victims were kidnapped by bandits on October the 31st when they invaded the Emmanuel Baptist Church in Kakao Daji in the Chukun local government area of the state. Meanwhile, a motor bomb exploded early Saturday morning in a residential estate in Meduguri. The name of the estate is 1000 Housing Estate, located along the Meduguri Damaturu Expressway. At least 12 houses were affected, but no loss of life has been recorded. And the Delta State Government has vowed to investigate the controversial death of Down College student Sylvester Oromoni Jr. In a statement on Saturday, Governor Okoa said he was fully in support of the Lagos State Government's decision to launch an investigation into the death of Sylvester, who was also a native of Ori South local government area in Delta State. On the international scene, Gambians voted on Saturday in the first presidential election in the tiny West African nation since former dictator Yaya Jame fled into exile. The voting will be closely watched as a test of the democratic transition in the Gambia, where Jame ruled for 22 years after seizing power in a bloodless coup in 1994. And in sports, Thomas Tuchel admitted Chelsea pay the price for too many individual mistakes as Arthur Musaku's late winner gave West Ham a shock 3-2 victory on Saturday. It was the Blues' first defeat in their last 13 games in all competitions and their spell at the top of the Premier League might be over by the end of today. And that's the Evening News Recap. Join us tomorrow for more updates. I'm Tenyo Shuboale. Thanks for watching.